Hey, welcome back for another Gorgon Chronicles update. In this case, pretty much this is the finished uh, framework for the engine room. Uh, once again, the textures aren't uh, finished, but in this case we see uh, the engine uh, in place here in the engine room. Uh, this engine room sets about 30 meters across, and you can see the uh, rather ineffectual radiation shielding here. The hole in the wall is where the big door frame goes. It's actually quite a bit bigger than that hole, so uh, actually it should cover up the... Uh, texture will be a little bit off center but it should look about right when the door frame gets in there um, and basically the, uh, the engine room is pretty darn uh, melty towards the back I mean that, that sort of is the theme of the thing uh, in this case I haven't quite got the roof on yet but all the other place pieces are in place and I need to finish that uh, but basically it's working out pretty darn good I'm, I'm thinking this is this has turned out pretty nice um, still not sure about the colors on the engine, what parts should be glowing and what not, so it may have a corroded metal look to it when it gets done, those little uh, round things around it. Um, and I'm still not sure if I'm going to do the uh, radiation shielding or in the circle. It's probably going to be a separate object uh, as well as the engine just to uh, keep the polygon count low. And also I was thinking about the radiation symbol that's on there. I was thinking about making that radiation symbol, uh, A, the, the gray is the wrong shade of gray, it needs to be darker, but also so it, it flashes uh, through a series of three things so it, it like glows and looks a little more serious. Uh, overall, I'm really happy with the way it, it's turned out. It looks pretty darn good. There's some little bit of a stretching on the pattern on the floor, but hey, the rest of the room is melting, so who cares? <laughs> looks like a fun place to work, huh? Well, join us for another Gorgon Chronicles update soon.